Hurricane Milton continues to churn out there over the Gulf of Mexico. We're going to talk that latest track in today's wet weather. Rapid intensification early this morning through this afternoon with winds now reaching 180 miles per hour as category five. Milton will be moving east over the next couple of days. A lot of rain with this. That central pressure, though, continues to drop. We're going to be watching that, and it's going to maintain Category 5 strength for the next 24-plus hours before starting a weekend just a tad prior to landfall late Wednesday into Thursday morning. Wind shear along the Florida coast going to be helping and aiding some of that slight weakening, but regardless, a major hurricane at landfall, and this could be moving anywhere from Tampa Tampa to Fort Myers or possibly even a little north before that continues tracking straight through the Florida Peninsula and then back out into the Atlantic. Storm surge is going to be catastrophic with some places seeing surge upwards of 10 to even 12 feet. That would be from Tampa and then south. The highest surge going to be all on kind of that eastern portion of Milton as it moves inland and Fort Myers down to Naples could also see that catastrophic storm surge. The water is going to cause problems everywhere besides just the coast, but this would be the latest major hurricane added to the list. A major land falling hurricane since 2017. Worth noting, Michael, who made landfall in October of 2018, was also Category 5 there at landfall. We'll talk more about Milton as well as any rain chances here in Texoma coming up tonight right here on K10.